All right, guys, what's up? It's He King here, bringing you a live reaction to the Silent Hill transmission. So in about three minutes, we're supposed to be getting a Silent Hill event. Uh, before I start, remember to like and subscribe, of course, technically I've already started, but yeah, never mind. Like and subscribe, please. Comment down below if you will after this. Give me your thoughts below. Ooh. It's 9.46 at the moment here. The event starts in three minutes, so it's, it says at 9.50. You know, we still have four minutes, technically. But yeah, apparently we're going to get a reveal for Silent Hill 2 Remake. Uh, a new game called Silent Hill Ascension, apparently. And uh, a reveal at the new Silent Hill movie done by the original director. Uh, right, so I'm trying, to, I'm trying to calculate this. 11, 21... Hmm. I was thinking maybe they would do this for like a 20th anniversary, but I don't think that would work, would it? Like, it's, it's already past the 24th anniversary, we're in the 22nd now, 23rd maybe, 24th, but the movie came out in uh, 06, so what, uh, 16, 20, so maybe the movie will come out on the, in, in, in 2026 to sort of uh, meet the 20th anniversary deadline maybe or something, uh, and that way they can celebrate it like that, or maybe, I don't know, it, it depends what we find out today, I mean, we, we don't know how far along these games are, and that's if you even that's if it's even a game. We don't know if it's a game. It could it could not be a game. It might be something else entirely. So you know. Oh God. Sixty seconds. Are you guys excited? Are you excited? I can't hear you. Come on, come on, give me those screams. I'm not the biggest Silent Hill fan, by the way. I played one and I played two, and I played a tiny bit of three at the beginning, and then I just stopped because that HD collection, honestly, was uh, it was kind of it was kind of crap. <laughs> uh, but um, no, I, I would have liked to. I, I honestly regret not sitting down and finishing it. It's one of those games I do wish I had sat down and properly played instead of using a guide. Yes, I used a guide because I couldn't be asked to just play for it properly. But uh, yeah, regrets, 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 and hopefully it won't be the same case with this when it comes out. Um, I do want to support this if it's good. So fingers crossed that it's that it's good. But yeah guys, we're just seconds away from uh, the premiere. I'm probably gonna have to turn the volume down for the audio on this so you guys can hear me and what I'm saying. Uh, let me see if I'm in the camera view. I am in the camera view. My back's killing me, but I am getting excited. I'm getting those uh, what is it? Those brain chemicals going in my body right now, like getting me excited, you know, taking away the pain. We've got the resin we'll showcase tomorrow as well. So, you know, ooh, killing two birds with one stone, you know, or as you as you will, killing two birds in one week. <laughs> should we just hide the chat? Or should we just keep the chat there so we can see what everyone's saying on the YouTube, on the YouTube chat? I'm, I'm scared this is going to like, I better turn the battery on actually on my laptop. There we go, because we're at 42%. And this event's like, what, 48 minutes long, so, you know, keep it up and coming. Imagine if it's a poker game, or what do you call it, like a pachinko machine, again. Holy crap, that would be annoying. The amount of people that would lose their crap if it's that, oh my god. We're at 9.50, and so far nothing. It's a scam, people! It's nothing! Nothing's happening! We're supposed to press play. I'm pressing play, but nothing's happening. It's a bit weird that they would remake uh, Silent Hill 2 and not Silent Hill 1. I would prefer, I think I'd prefer, but then Pyramid Head is such an iconic villain, to be honest, so it just makes sense, doesn't it? What's going on, guys? Like, come on. Seriously? I wonder which one I should upload this to, to my gaming channel or to the current channel? Hmm. Hmm. Makes sense to upload it to the gaming channel, doesn't it? Then I just want that to be specifically on games that I'm playing. Currently playing for Last of Us 2 at the moment. Yes, I decided to start playing Last of Us 2. I know I'm a hypocrite, but uh, yeah, gameplay-wise is not that bad. Story-wise, though, it's a bloody nightmare. But, uh, you know, hopefully this is better gameplay-wise and story-wise. <laughs> We're one minute past the deadline and so far nothing. Okay, someone in the chat saying it's starting in eight minutes or something. Oh wait, here we go. 
It wasn't a scam. I'm refreshing it. I can hear the sound. Is that pyramid head? So wait, this is this is in real life. This video is already completed. Right, I'm gonna skip ahead to see when it starts. So twenty. Five minutes, are you kidding me? Right. Turning it down. Fifteen, fourteen, thirteen, twelve, eleven, ten, nine, eight, wait, and six, that was five. Well, forget it, just show me the... Straight off of a trailer, okay, is this gonna look good or... It's sort of a rat we stop with a cockroach in this, in this, in this, in this franchise. Act of the day of like, 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 no, it's James. Could she really be here? Oh my god, we're what getting are you for me. We're getting a remake. We're getting a remake of two. It's legit. Mary died of that damn disease three years ago. Is this actual gameplay right now? In my restless oh dreams, my God. I see that town. Silent Hill. Let's see. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's developed by Blue Point. That's not good. I've not heard good things about Blue Point. Oh, boy. Oh look, they, they've even kept that scene. I know what you are. I know why I needed you. Oh man. But it's all over now. I'm ready. It's crazy that we're getting a remake, man. Mary? Pyramid Head in all his glory. Silent Hill 2, watch this now, PS5. It's exclusive to PS5. Unreal Engine, developed by Blue Petit. See, that's the only thing that's like sort of making me go, ooh, this is gonna be bad, because I've not heard good things about Blue Petit.
PlayStation console exclusive. That's crazy. That's insane. Welcome to Silent Hill Transmission, the show that keeps you informed about Silent Hill. My name is Selena, and I will be your facilitator. Thank you very much for having me. And. Nice to meet you too. Really care about that. It's a good way to get excited. そしてですね、より詳しくお伝えするために一緒にゲームを作っている人をお呼びしています。では早速ご紹介いたします。コンセプトアーティストの伊藤正弘さんです。コンセプトアーティスト。伊藤さん今日はよろしくお願いします。よろしくお願いします。よろしくお願いします。ます改めまして岡本さん伊藤さんサイレントヒルが帰ってくるんですね。はいそうなんです。Dear fans, thank you very much for your patience. Silent Hill is back as the first part of this project. We will remake Silent Hill 2. It's a bit weird. That the, I mean, yeah, it's the most popular one, but still, it's been almost three years since we approached Mr. Ito. It's been a really long time. Is it going to be extended? Is there going to be new things in it? Or is it just going to be like a graphic or enhancement? Everyone think Dust Scarlet was the one who first spoke of it. He's the one who first revealed that there was going to be a remake, and no one believed him. Okay. I am personally very happy that this game, which is more than 20 years old, is being revived again. It's a new game in the form of a remake. At the time, we were trying to take on various challenges. Keep hearing noises by my door, like what? I was trying to create something new and unprecedented as a theme. Even within the context of video games. The tag director, Chizuru Chakbara, and I said, I would be doing this kind of punishment. I was working on the music, but I also remember that I was trying to... Oh, right, he's the dude who did the composing for the music in there. Yeah, okay, fair enough, that's cool. They need the same kind of music in the side of the movie. みんなの心の中に残ってるっていうのは僕はすごく。リメイクにおいてはまたさらに新しい音楽性であったり、新しいチャレンジもそうかもしれないし。I want to know about the gameplay. Is it expanded or is it different? What's going on? もちろん、サイレントヒルを知らない、サイレントヒルを知らないユーザーさんにとってもその時サイレントヒル2を初めて作ったのはインパクトというか衝撃というか作れたらいいなと思っています。皆さんもぜひ楽しみにしていてください。They didn't reveal, they didn't give a release date, so thank you very much, Mr. Mm. One of the young sound staff at Konami looked up to Mr. Yamaha, like Yamaha. Everyone is very excited to work with him. I know not only in Japan, let me tell you more about the production team as well. This time, I found it in Tsububa Team, Craigley, and Stillman. They were in the media, they made it. Yeah, no way. No, 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 no. I've not heard good things from these guys. Silent Hill 2 is a cult classic, and it's widely recognized as one of the best games ever made. Yeah, but do you For realize Malibu that? For Malibu team members, Silent Hill is the title which made them fall in love in horror games. No, for me it was Resident Evil, so no. <laughs> This is why we approach our work with a great respect to our genre. Okay. To ensure that we are keeping this unique Silent Hill atmosphere intact, we are working closely with original creators, good, good. such as Masahiro Ito and Akira Yamaoka. Good. At least, at least, at least they get that part. You know, they're keeping it. Those don't just 
We want Silent Hill 2 to make the same strong impression today that the original game did 21 years ago. While we want to achieve the same end result, players' expectations evolve over time, and certain things need to be modernized to have the same or similar effect. For example, that's why we went with the over-the-shoulder camera, right, yes. so we can immerse players into the Good, game so that we already got that. We are creating a synergy where new or modernized mechanics and features actually support the original spirit of Silent Hill 2. Combining the old with the new is no easy task, but we believe we are on the right track. They only showed Mary's character. To put it simply, our goal go. is to recreate everything what made the game a timeless classic, but give it a new form which will draw players even deeper into the foggy streets of Silent Hill. They have one job and they can't screw this up. They have one job, they need to get this right. Silent Hill 2 is being developed from the studio.彼らは本当にこのゲームばかりなんですよね。大好きで。コナミって最大のタイトルの会社で世界中のチームがバイトしないように提案をいただくんですけど、その中でも彼らは最も情熱的で、すごく。Why <笑> <laughs> yeah, too bad you didn't discuss. I mean, these guys work on Sino, so technically they wouldn't be involved in Metal Gear Solid and everything. I don't care about these. I, I, I want to see. Hello, everyone. My name is Christian Svensson, and I'm the vice president of global third party relations at Sony Interactive Entertainment. I'm extremely excited to hear about the announcement of Silent Hill 2. Congratulations. This is definitely a celebratory moment, and we're looking forward to bringing Silent Hill 2 exclusively okay. to PlayStation 5. Okay. Being huge fans of the franchise, our team at SIE feels fortunate and excited to support the revival of Silent Hill. Okamoto-san, we eagerly await hearing more about what's in store for this beloved franchise. All right. Thank you again for your partnership. Thank you for your support. Yeah, so as going to get on PlayStation. These haven't been on other consoles? Why does no one love the first game? あの、ファンの皆様にはですね、あの、本日からプレイステーション this show doesn't end with the introduction of Silent Hill 2. We will continue to work with tentacles to create more of the goal to expand the world of Silent Hill. I wish you would expand the world of Metal Gear Solid and uh, Castlevania. Yo, boy. Why are you here? No. In this place, why are you here? You're to be punished. That's good, I like it. You know what, I think you're right. I think we've done something so awful. Where does it start? We are stuck here in this place, being judged by these people. But for you, I think it's more than that. No court, I don't court day. I think you're here for some other reason. And I don't want to be anywhere near you. Can you figure that out? It's just like a portable game. Silent Hill Townfall. Oh, that's meh.
What is that? Hi, my name is John McKellen. I'm the creative director at No Code, and we are working on Silent Hill Townfall. I remember playing the original Silent Hill on PS1 back in 1999 and became a fan from that moment on. So for us to work on this game with our friends at Annapurna feels like an actual dream come true. It's a real honour for us to bring a new title to this series that both respects the source material, but also does something a little bit different with it. To say that Silent Hill has been an inspiration to No Code would be a massive understatement. I don't even know who the Our same previous two is. games, Stories Untold and Observation, both played with that same deep psychological horror. And at No Code, we're all about weaving that narrative and that experience into every aspect of our game design, our audio, our visuals, even our UI. So obviously the teaser trailer is just the beginning, and we can't show you any more just yet. Well, that We're going to be hard at work for a while, uh, but we can't wait to come back in the new year and show you more. What is this, a console Until game? Then, what is it? It might be worth watching that trailer again and see what you might have missed. I'm good. I don't really, want to, I don't really need to see it again. あの、ここででは、ここでアシスタントプロデューサー、ナイトルイさんを迎えして、その新たな展開について伺っていきましょう。I'm still in a few years ago, the producer of the original Silent Hill got in touch, right, when the Resident Evil movie was over. This guy's been directed the first film, said he would direct again. Ah, yes. The received a fantastic film concept as well, and this is going to be a great film. I liked, I loved the first Silent Hill movie, I think it's great, actually. The second one was crap, but... Probably wondered why it was enough just to make, to make a new film. We wanted to bring back the game series as well, so since then, together with us, uh, we have been on the road to revive the games. Yep. Oh, is this the first movie or is this a new one? Oh, that's sweet. Return to Silent Hill. That's what it's called, yes. Return to Silent Hill. This return is my return to a world, a universe, that I have uh, touched in uh, 2006. I wanted to see this in cinemas back in 2006 and I couldn't. And, we decided to go and I was like freaking 16 years old and I couldn't because I was, my, my, my friends' dad wouldn't let him. The film is the story of a young guy coming back to Silent Hill where he has known uh, a great love. And what he's going to find is a, a pure nightmare. I have the chance of being very close with Christoph, and we together has achieved to, to convince Konami that there is a new uh, version of Silent Hill that needs to be done, and they are 100%. Ig ignore bored. revelations, ignore that movie happening. The first Silent Hill, we were exploring the world, the world of this small town completely uh, closed into, into the mist. It was like being trapped into the, a Twilight Zone. But in the second game, you know, the, the creator of the game have changed the rules, you know. We were basically going back to Silent Hill, the same town, but we were looking at this strange world entirely through the, the point of view of the hero we were playing. Mm -hmm. Who was supposed to be Sean Bean in the in the third one, I imagine, that we were supposed to get, but we never did. realize that Mary is lost somewhere into this... So this is going to be an adaptation of Silent Hill 2. 
at its core, it's also the idea of the myth of Orpheus. And whatever a, a man can go deep in hell to bring back the soul or the person he loves the most in his life. So it's much more about psychological horror. Even if we are going to find again all the same creature and the same strange terror sequence. I imagine that the tie this into the first, first big movie tradition, somehow. And the first big terror is about ourselves. Are we mad? Are we sane? Are, are we sane to go back to Silent Hill to find this great love? This one now has so many years from the first one that there is a clear. I love how no one brings up the second Christoph one like it never happened. To make it modern, but also very true to the video game. And that's also what it is. We are also respecting the will of the author, the producers, and Konami into this uh, adaptation. Christoph, it's really somebody that respects the work that has been done, but that also has his own vision. It nurtures the creative vision of the authors from the game, but with a different vision from a filmmaker. And both they have created, I believe, something that has struck the mind of the fans. I feel like they're just copying the second yeah! one, like, bit, bit by bit. <laughs> Stop! Game of Silent Hill franchise were great artistic achievements, and I have a responsibility to transpose that on the big screen, you know. Christoph is a real gamer. He has been immersed in this world. That's why um, the first film was so well received by the fans of Silent Hill, because they felt that uh, I was one of them, and it was so important for me to, to respect the original creation. That, that was the base, the start of everything. Everything starts from this respect. So I'm going with a maximum of humility. My God, it's crazy to think that the second respect. Silent Hill movie had but freaking Jon Snow in it. Like, Kate Harrington was in that. Before he did Game of Thrones, he was in that movie. Let that sink in. Kate Harrington was in that, for I say. Which is entirely about immersion into a tale, into a story that we can tell in. 90, 100 minutes. Yeah, no, I can see. That's a flop already. Like, I don't feel like you can do that. The key elements that the fans are waiting for, and we are updating those in a way that the creation is similar, but they will be striking. For me, one of my major goals in this film is how to redesign the classic monster of Silent Hill. I was talking about Red Pyramid, you know, the big guy with the helmet, you know. He's again in this one. Of course he Some is. Some of the pictures of the film of, uh, back in uh, 2006 were very, very appreciated by, by the fan. But in the same time, for me, it was, it was important to come back with, with surprise. It's a new universe. It's a new challenge. And those are very KFC. important Does that, to bring to say KFC, those then? icons differently to the because they want them to have that wow effect. That's why, you know, I found a very interesting collaboration with the people of Konami. They helped me a lot to achieve this new design of the monster because they are also working on new episodes for the franchise of Silent Hill. New episodes, what does that mean? The younger audience, they want that collective experience. They want to be with their friends, they want to talk about it, but they want also to live that experience together. We all know that uh, watching an horror film alone at his home is quite different of being into a big theater with a crowd and everybody jumping at the same time. It's very different. We are modernizing. We are giving him what the audience of today is really wanting. We are trying to do as much as possible. That's the problem. You try to too, too much and it falls apart. That audience. Don't do Could that. Just keep it simple and, and good. Interactive. And we have now new technologies, but we still have what makes the best is the story. And this story is at the core of it. So we hope that Return to Silent Hill will be a great return. Mm, if we want I doubt it. Uh, to keep the link with the audience, you know, we have to, to be perfectly aware that everything has changed. 15 years, everything has been washed away. We have to bring back something, you know, very surprising. Bring back the actors, like the original actors. <laughs>
プロデューサー監督ありがとうございました、so、ゲームを映画に負けないように頑張っていこうと思ってます映画とゲーム両方を最高のクオリティにしてファンにお届けしたいと思ってますもうファンとしては両方とも本当に楽しみです内藤さん映画もゲームもまだまだこれからだと思うんですけれども今後の予定などってお聞きすることってできますでしょうかさっきのあの映像の中にもあったと思うんですけどまあすでに絵コンテとかイメージボードとかあるんですけど実は撮影とかしているのはまだこれからなんですねまあ今後いろいろ映画の方も山場がいっぱいあると思うんでこちらの方もまあゲームと一緒にいい作品になるように進めていきたいと思ってますありがとうございます映画も楽しみですこの配信をご覧の皆さんもぜひ楽しみにお待ちくださいねそれではこの回もそろそろ内藤さん岡本さんありがとうございましたもし。The base、Loki. capturing the scaffold can、Loki. be connected, and you can recreate the scene of the final fight against two red pyramid things. Up next, James Sunderland 1 6th scale statue. The realistic sculpture perfectly captures James's、okay, saucer facial expression. See, Not only the handgun, but also the wooden plank, yes, the yes, steel、no. pipe, and the great knife pairing up with red pyramid、no. thing can be held、Run. in his right hand. At his feet, health drinks are tossed away. Maria from Silent Hill 2 is also coming as a one six scale statue. It is the very first official statue of Maria with the high quality and beautiful details. The right、hurts. hand is interchangeable、oh、my God, with the h a n d h o l d i n the gun, which appears in the sub scenario Born from a Wish. Last but not least, the secret ending of Silent Hill 2, Inu End, is also recreated as、secret、a one six scale statue. These hand number limited decks are now available for pre order. In the official Konami shop, all these products are now available. Please check it out. Here is further information about Silent Hill goods. From Crazy Rock, one six scale fully articulated thing,、right? collectible figures of Red Pyramid Thing and Bubblehead Nurse are just coming. Ascension. They are high quality and fully articulated. From Good Smile Company, Papa Parade Bubblehead Nurse is coming with affordable prices. Papa Parade is a series of figures that are easy to collect. Each figure typically stands around 17 to 18 centimeters in height. From Bedrock Collectibles, Red Pyramid Thing and Maria Elevator Chase. Why do they call it Red Pyramid Thing? This statue diorama captures a moment. Isn't it red? Isn't it pyramid head? Red Pyramid Thing readies to swing his great blade while Maria attempts to run away and reach the elevator in time. With her outreached hand. This diorama will be coming soon to the Bedrock Collectibles website. Konami is proud to present all these items on Silent Hill e commerce page. Don't miss it and secure your order. Is this going to be like the Final Fantasy、um, event where they then reveal like a big game? It's like, we're proud to announce that they're cool, we're great, we're great, and as a high degree. Okay. Now the scene has changed and we have our next guest. Our next guest is Jacob Navok. Jacob, please introduce yourself. Hi, my name is Jacob Navok, and I'm the CEO at Genbit. Jacob, what will you be presenting this time? I'm going to show you a new kind of Silent Hill, an experience that you haven't seen up until now. A whole new experience. What is it all about? Please take a look at this video for him. Our English is very good.
Ascension, there we go. Bad robot games, what? What's this? It's a multiplayer, that's to be. Live, 20.3. Pace your drama together, is it? Well, this is going to be another world of Silent Hill. Jacob, could you please introduce your project? For over 20 years, Silent Hill has haunted my memories. And lately, I enjoy watching streamers playing Silent Hill with their fans. We love the feeling of being scared together, of experiencing fear with friends. It's why watching horror films in the theater is so fun. Silent Hill Ascension takes that feeling of communal fear to a massive scale. It's a live, real-time interactive series where millions of fans will watch together as the chilling story unfolds. Okay. You can change its outcomes and even be a part of scenes. There is no reset button. Decisions that you make mean life or death in the story. It's your chance to shape Silent Hill canon forever. Silent Hill Ascension is brought to you by Genvid, Bad Robot, Behavior, and DJ2. It goes live in 2023. Yeah, it's going to Sign be up at Ascension.com for updates. I don't know. I'm so excited like this. about this new world of Silent Hill. Here are some messages we received from two important partners in the project. One Before of them, we look Abrams. at the messages, could you please introduce them? Today we're going to hear from Bad Robot as well as Behavior. I see. Okay, first things first. I would like to read... Oh my god, I was right. It is J.J. Abrams. Genfit's experience presents a wild, epic... Yeah, you know this project's going to be a flop because this dude never completes anything. ...in the horrors of Silent Hill. Next, please watch the message from the art director of Bad Robot and the creative team of Behavior Interactive. I'm Chris Amaral from Bad Robot Games and art director for Silent Hill Ascension. I didn't even know Bad Robot had a game Our division. approach to Silent Hill Ascension is to ensure we maintain the tone and the feeling that the fans have come to love from the franchise, while also adding our own twist of an oppressed, tormented, and morose dimension of reality. Silent Hill creatures are often manifested projections from the darkest depths of the main character's minds. In Silent Hill Ascension, we build off of this. Our creatures are inspired by the personal traumas and internal demons of our characters' past lives. We want the art style to be a fresh take on the brand, while still being equally respectful to where we've been before. In 2021, we released The Executioner and the survivor Cheryl Mason in Dead by Daylight. Today, so looks behavior like we're once again game will dive the into the this. world of Silent Hill. I know, spoilers, but... A completely new experience. I'm an, I'm an, I'm an impatient Here's person. Here's Chris, VP creative well, I'm just going to text my friend let know. ...to tell you all about it. Everyone at Behavior is excited to announce our collaboration with Genvid on Silent Hill Ascension in a new form of entertainment that blends community, live storytelling, and interactivity. Silent Hill Ascension takes you and the entire community on a unique interactive storytelling experience where the decisions you make affect the characters and the world. Those decisions become canon, and there's no reset button. This is a whole new chapter for Silent Hill, with new characters and frightful monsters, where the stakes couldn't be more real. We're thrilled to be working with the talented teams at Genvid, Bad Robot, and DJ2 to bring Silent Hill Ascension to life. Look for it to go live in 2023, and sign up at ascension.com for updates. I can see the new charm of Silent Hill. The fun only gets better. Jacob, what do you think of the two message videos? I am thrilled to work with these incredible teams. Together, we're going to revolutionize what horror means in interactive media. That's fantastic. We are excited, too. I hope everyone watching this distribution is eagerly waiting this new Silent Hill. I'm sure you will not be disappointed. Thank you, Jacob, for sharing your fascinating title with us today. Thank you for your time, Jacob. Thank you very much. また場所が変わりましたね。岡本さんこれはどういうことでしょうか。はい。実は最後のワイポン、サイレントヒルの完全新作の発表があります。我々が自信を持って送り出す。All right, here we go. Yeah, saving the best for last, yeah. Thank you
finally, we will leave you with that completely new video. Thank you for watching Silent Hill Transmission. So no one predicted Silent Hill, Townfall, and whatever this is. No actual, so this is not actual gameplay footage. It looks good. Oh, is this like a Japanese theme Silent Hill game? Interesting. Here we get to new samurai swords. I don't want to be cliche here, but come on. When, when you want to. F using a samurai sword to fight the pyramid and like... <laughs> How cool would that be? You're telling me this is not actual gameplay. You're going to get affected by the... By the roots of the other world. This is really, sorry, this is a really interesting concept. Oh, oh, that's disgusting. I've heard of that condition where you've got like holes in your body or people imagine you've got holes in, that's horrible. <coughs> oh, that's disgusting. Interesting concept, so I guess it's gonna be gory and lots of flowers. Silent Hill? F? What does the F mean? Oh, Silent Hill flowers? Is that what it means? Story. Who that? Who's that? Creature and Kara. Lisa, Motoro, Okamoto. Developed by Neil Bards Entertainment. Is over. Okay, it's over. The game screen on the game screen is on development. Please note that product uh, all back uh, are on development. Okay. Okay, that was a decent event. Okay, Silent Hill is back, ladies and gentlemen. It's back, like holy crap. Um, yeah. What more can I say? Like, I'm looking forward to seeing the remake for two. Whenever we're gonna get it, like I don't know when that's gonna be. It came out in 2001, right? 20, 20, yeah, 2001. So let's see, 11, 21. What's the best time that they could release? What that it could technically come out in? The 25th anniversary. When would that be? That would be that would be 2006, and that would be the same. That would be the 20th anniversary of the Silent Hill movie as well. Isn't that a bit ridiculous though? They announce all of this stuff and then it all comes out in four years' time. That's a bit late, isn't it? Unless we get some of these other games. No, but it, that wouldn't make sense. Hmm. Hmm. How's the marketing for this going to work, I think? I wonder. I really do wonder. But yeah, that was a fun event. Can't wait to play it. And yeah, guys, that's, that's that. I'm going to end it here. Uh... Yeah. Remember to like and subscribe, guys. I hope you like this. And I can't wait to see what the future holds for Silent Hill. And yeah, I can't wait for tomorrow with the RE4 showcase. Well, technically RE showcase because it's RE4 and uh, RE Village and whatever. But yeah, uh, when is this going to be uploaded? I don't know, probably over the weekend. But uh, we'll see. Maybe tomorrow. Probably tomorrow? No, I'm not going to have time. I'm probably going probably gonna to do it. Yeah, I'm probably going to do it when I get home. So I've got like Friday and off. So but this will probably be edited and uploaded by Friday or Saturday. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be a late upload. Anyway, guys, take care and bye. Take care and bye.